the evidence is so compelling, it should not go in cartel's favor. No, no, but the Constitution says that you're entitled to a trial by an independent and impartial tribunal. And that is a standalone position. If you don't get that, then you must be free. What well, one people, one how you do for everybody doing good as always. Is me over there with some fresh updates from Vibes Cartel, UK Privy Council appeal. You see me? Based on information where would that get? We are here say oh the verdict would be landed in around two to three months time. But now Bert Samuels, who also played a major part in this whole trial for Vibes Cartel, is actually giving us a different time frame. Yeah man people, but before we get into that, leave a like on the video and make sure to subscribe because I don't know so yes on to get the latest you see me. Yeah man, run up the likes to 100 likes quick and fast. And the Privy Council generally takes how long in arriving at a decision in cases like this? If you're using general, you're looking at two to three months. If you're looking at Cartel's case, which is 9,000 pages, five times the size of a normal appeal, you're looking for late summer, possible mid-summer for this matter to be the judgment to come out. It's going to be a written judgment. It's not just going to be a broadcast. It's going to be hundreds of pages, we assume. It takes them long and hard to go over 9,000 pages. Meanwhile, So according to Bert Samuels, we might not hear a verdict not until August, September, or possibly even October because of the amount of file they have to go through. 9,000 pages. Just imagine that on your desk. Jaja, this might be the most the most um pages them ever got through. Speaking about the Privy Council, yeah, yeah, this might be the most pages them ever got through. The biggest case them ever get to deal with in them life. You see me? Yeah. So Bert Samuel is basically I'm gonna know. So this is not just a general appeal. No, this is not them something you know, usually ab abnormal things. Them. So basically, while we are expecting that vibes cartel. Would I get a verdict in our own, possibly our own May, beginning of summer? Bird Samuels is now saying late summer. You see me? So, Vibes Cartel have yeah, more, around six months or more before I get a verdict. You see me? Yo, half a year that. <laughs> but, anyways, people, Bird Samuels also stated in the same interview that he did with the ER that he thinks that. Vibes Cartel, Sean Stam, and the man them will be getting a retrial. While many others think that the case will be thrown out or overturned by the Privy Council, Bert Samuels actually believes say our oh, retrial go on, which means say uh, um the Privy Council will be sending back this case to the Court of Appeal in Jamaica to decide Vibes Cartel verdict again. You see me? I know this is one news where most people now go like. Especially if you are supporting fans of Vibes Cartel. Neutral people will okay with it you now. But the diehard fans them definitely not going to like this any at all. Because um, Isaac Buchanan made it clear in the, proof, in the appeal. Saying that the poison is already injected. There is no way Vibes Cartel will be getting a fair and unbiased trial. Excluding everything that happened in the initial trial, you know, yeah, they might make sure say all of that them follow the books to the T, you know, but now it's all based on the jurors' discretion, you see me, where they hold them feel about vibes cartel because feelings in a heat, you know, you see me, I say discretion, all of that. So, with what them already know, and all of them something, the people. I go play a big part in other retrial. Which means as we Isaac Buckyan and say yo, the, the trial it, it's not gonna be unbiased. It's more gonna be an unbiased and not a fair trial again. Even though this time they are gonna follow the books to the T to ensure that it not reach back at the Privy Council. Even though there is actually another way to look at it now, because the court of appeal cannot look upon and say yo they make mistake in at the initial stage and them would want to make mistake again if you kind of show up the justice um system is what i say and show up them unprofessionalism and all of them something there so they might go the route and it end up that vibes cartel and the man them 
are favored in this trial. You see me? I remember, you know, as me say, and a robot I do them something, you are humans. Literal humans with feelings and emotions. You see me? So, it can go that way and it can go the other way away. The trial is still biased. You see me? So, we are wait to see all of that we are going as we may say. This is one news where most Gaza fans, if not all Gaza fans, would not want to hear. Most people, including Isaac Buchanan, want this court, that want these um, charges to be overturned. Yes, we may say this conviction to be overturned. You see me? And that would have been the more favorable result for Vibes Cartel and the Monday because now, if them go back and read trial now, no people, remember how long the first trial lasts? Now, this is one it not gonna last so long, you know, that them already know the core base. The information is already there. But now the mafia look on expenses. Them liar, yeah, me know if you have facts, yo. Them, them liar, yeah, and this is a high profile case, yeah, the expenses. Expensive. But we know the vibes cartel of the money, without doubt. You see me? And a whole lot of things. It would be like doing over the trial all over again. You see me? It's just time. This time it's gonna be way shorter. But definitely, according to Bert Samuels, Vibes Cartel will not be get, and the man them will not be getting a verdict until late summer. You see me? Not a news many want to hear, but we just have to accept it based on the nature of um, this case, this appeal. You see me, people? But yeah, just like you know the update as always, you know, don't know it go. Definitely want to hear your know, thoughts on this in the comment section. Want to know if you know, agree with what Bert Samuel say in regards to the retrial. If you know, feel like Vibes Cartel and the man them are going to get a retrial. I don't know, feel like say, yo, the, the court, the court of appeal, the privy council rather, will be um, overturning. Um, the decision that was initially made to charge Vibes Cartel and them and them giving them life. Definitely want for you your thoughts on this in the comment section. But as always, I will keep you guys posted on this. Go to the necessary update them. Remember to leave a like on the video. You zoom me say? Yeah, very important. If you're new to this channel, please consider subscribing because I just want to get latest. Also, share the video across every single platform so everybody can be in the known as well. You see me? I'm out. Um, the final question is that of remission. In my submission, this could hardly be more ser a more serious case. It is of particular concern that we are talking here about great celebrities. That doesn't mean that you apply a different standard, but of course it does mean, in my respectful submission, that such a high-profile case with on the face of it such overwhelming evidence. <laughs> uh, most of it, of course, not the entirety of it, uh, being of a technical nature and so forth. Um, I submit this would be an appropriate case for the matter to be remitted for a retrial. My lords, I don't think on the whole you yourselves do that. You normally send it back to the Court of Appeal to consider. Mm -hmm. But I would submit there's every reason, if I'm wrong, for the, for, the, for the Court of Appeal to consider what to do.